Alright, let's play some more FTL. Let's try this again. The Sarenkov NGC. Uh, what else needs to be said? It's a terrible ship. And... I'll try my best to get a win with it. We got a little close. We got pretty close last time. We got a lot of, uh... A lot of good things with that glaive beam. We just couldn't get it up and running. So... I will attack the pirate here. And... It makes sense to get this up and running. And we'll pop this backup battery soon. Barring a hit. Actually, we're just going for it. Works out. Alright, let's see if the beam drone can do anything for us here. That's good. Hits the weapons. They're going to try and run. If their engines are offline. Okay, I think we got them. No problem with the first fight. Combat drone. Hey. I like that. So. What are we going to do? We're going to... Upgrade our drone control. 75 is the magic number. Alright, well I don't want to go to that store. So, I'll try and ignore it. Although, now that I'm thinking about it, we're going to run out of drone parts if we do that. Fight the ship. One thing's for certain, we're fighting the ship. So what's better? Beam or combat? I'm pretty sure... Beam is still better. Combat drone can miss, beam drone can't. It would help if we play our back battery efficiently. Get hit by a missile. What? Oh my gosh, it's just like so unbelievable. So, uh, if you're not aware what happened, that laser fire hit our drone out the air, and we really can't do anything without. Okay, should have seen that coming. That missed, which is incredible. Why am I sending you there? I don't know. What's going to fire first? It doesn't matter. There goes the drone control. Please. It would. The jump would spawn right as we we're getting hit. I hate this ship. It's so bad. Useless Zoltans. I guess, well, the thing is, you don't want to move your pilot because you won't be able to dodge. But. I don't know. I guess we get power because we need it. My initial thought was get the um, get the drone control up and running so that you can use both drones. But the only issue with that is you're going to run out of drone parts. So it's just not really viable. Okay, we'll give this a go, I guess. Put that there. And... 
get the drone going. Okay. Not too bad so far. Uh, that's not going to help us because it's a missile, but... Okay. Bean drones managed to get the weapons offline. Which is a nice change of pace from what we're no normally used to. Okay, I need the beam drone up and running. So. There you have it. Double rewards. I'll take it. I'll get my power. And actually, that is how we want it, I believe. Okay, we made it to the quest beacon. So, before we get there, let's go to a few more spots. I'll take that. And I think I'll get the last power bar. Put it there. We'll keep moving. We will never surrender one of our crew to slavers. start. They have a super um, super shield destroyer, but we've won and we've gotten stick. So, save stations there. Not bad. Got our pilot that's not a Zoltan. So, how do we do here? Give them the requested for fuel. 13 scrap. Oh, that is pitiful. Demand the surrender of their goods. Okay, they're trying to book it, so we may want to... Oh. You know, I was going to say, we may want to get this other combat drone into play, too. But we don't have the drone capacity to do that. So that was kind of dumb. So let's see if a uh, beam drone can figure it out. It's got piloting offline. That's a good start. Our shields will hold for the time being. Okay, our shields are going to hold still. Cool. We got them. That is a tiny amount of scrap. And let me see about getting... We are one scrap short from getting... Our fourth level of... Um, drone control. So I don't think a store is going to help us here. So let's... Hit up this sensor station. Or this station. Should be a pretty easy fight, I would think. Even with the misses. One more should do it. Beam drone, you can do it. I believe in you. Nine. Scrap. Okay, so, now if we're ever in a pinch, we can run both drones. And that's going to be a massive hog on our drone parts, but it must be done, I think. Alright, let's just go to the big... Uh, okay. It would appear we picked wrong. All right, put that there. Beam drone coming at you. This ship's not very strong, but uh, they're next to the sun, which is quite annoying. It'd be nice if uh, Super Shield blocked Solar Flare, but I'm just not. 
I don't think that's the case. an easy enough fight. There goes the fire. And we'll let the oxygen come back a little. And then we'll jump. Okay, store. I don't really have anything worth going to the store for. I will reject that offer, of course. Your extortion will not work on me. Pretty good. Really good. That'll take care of you. So, Distress Beacon seems like a pretty good choice. I see our fuel starting to dwindle. Markel is gone. Markel is back. Oh well. Uh, I'm starting to feel it with the fuel, so I'll move forward a little. Nothing going on there. Reject. I'm uh, not sure if we can get through this, but I'll give it a go. Alright, there it is. Double combat drones. And we have no way of controlling them. So really, we're just kind of hoping they somehow manage to get a hit through. They did. We've gotten one hit through. There's another hit. Okay. Digging it. Our backup battery is about to run out, which is not good. Do we have any power to spare? Yeah, from oxygen. Okay, I'll take the hit. Oh, that sucks. I didn't get through. Beam drone, I need you to slow down and let the combat drone hit first. There you go. Alright, it wasn't pretty. We need the fuel, so I dread having to take this, but I think it's in my best interest to do so. I'll jump here and then we'll like move around here for a bit, I think. And hopefully we'll run into another shop. Yeah, don't need crew. Shop is not a guarantee though. Nothing going on there. Ignore the damaged vessels. That first option will never be good for you. Should you select it. Boarding drone. Just really isn't much help. Okay. Well. I don't know. Let the fire consume, I guess. I knew we weren't going to be able to put it out in time, so. Just let it burn, I guess. Okay. There goes the fire. Send our nasty little Zoltans in to repair now. Okay. Let's see what's going on at either of these jumps. So, I was kind of hoping one of these would be a shop. We knew this one wasn't, so... 
think Distress Beacon would be better than nothing. And we have enough... No, can't do that. We have enough fuel to make it to the next sector, but we will run out upon reaching it. Oh, no, we won't. Well, that was fortuitous. I think we'll head up here, hit more green sectors. Low fuel, low drone parts, weapons aren't viable. Why on earth would I do that? Approach the station. Combat drones spawned in. Wow, that hit like a truck. Must be a heavy ion. Okay, this fight is under control though. As we slowly watch our drone parts dwindle down. Don't risk it, leave the station. I can't afford to throw away drone parts. As much as I would love to check up here for a shop, I can't because there's no way back over here. So let's go over here. Aid the civilian ship. Okay. It is what it is. Good double hit. Piloting's off. There goes the missiles. That's excellent. Alright. This is looking like a win. For this fight, at least. Not the run. Got some fuel, a little drone parts. We have enough here that we can forego this beacon. Nothing there. Unfortunate. Alright. Let's skip another one. Combat with double shields and a defense drone I think it's in my best interest to just leave without fighting so that's what I'll do and we'll probably get hit on our way out here it comes all right there's one FTL is halfway charged, so we're gonna get hit at least once more on the weapon. It's okay. They're actually gonna jump before us, which I'm not mad about at all. Double your fleet, see if I care. Okay, there's the charge ion back. Trying to find a shop. It's not working out. They're trying to escape. They have really good weapons, so. I don't like my chances. Now, I will say. Maybe we can get this charge ion to work. For us. Let's see how that does. Okay, that actually worked out. I'm kind of thinking. Throw everything we got at it now. Okay, we lost our combat drone. And we got hit twice, three times. So, yeah, that was kind of disaster. And, okay, their pilot left, which is huge. Pretty sure we need to keep hitting this. Take three damage there, and our hull is getting wrecked. Let's 
Is this gonna be enough? I don't think so, but... I can't... I can't use any more drone parts. I have to... I have to just go. They fire their ship, their uh, shot at me one more time, I'll just leave. Okay. It's a disaster. Alright. Have another beam drone. I uh, I really need a shop. Why fire? There's no point. Well, I guess there is a point to take their weapons down. Okay. Starting to sweat here with the hole, and man, with the hole, the fuel, the drone parts, the weapons, it's just not good. No, I don't want that there. I want on the weapons. That's an ion too. Okay, they've taken over our engine man. Oh no, the drone has been shot. That's lucky. Can you, like, stop him, please? Shoot. Okay, we are, like, super lucky not to have been hit there. And distress beacon. Is there, like, one shop on this map? Leave them to their fate. They're gonna double the fleet, and okay, well, it's time to go anyway. So double, double, two double fleet pursuits. Buying a crew member here would be foolish. So, NG Homeworld. Please, for the love of God, can I have a shop? Thank you. Now, can I buy some useful things here? Not on your life, right? Vulcan. Glaive Beam. I think we learned last time Glaive Beam isn't viable, but... Vulcan could potentially be on its own. It's kind of a wing and a prayer here, so... Let's try and get it going. Okay. Why... Why not? Thank you. So... You can have that, and that, and I need to heal. A defense drone would be a big help. All right, I think that's about as good as it's gonna is it's gonna get. You know, uh, we're still low on fuel, but we have a Vulcan. There's another store. The other store is not going to help, but uh, we might get some scrap to buy fuel from it. Okay, here's the quest beacon, I guess. Uh, take the cargo for yourself. A lot of scrap. Let's hit up this store. Okay, we've got a bit of a lifeline. Drone recovery arm would be huge. So I will take that. All right. Okay. So. Now what? There's the third store. I think we're good on stores now. A defense drone. Which is nice, but... Um, 
we already have one. Well, accept your surrender. That's for sure. Okay, let's get a power bar. Put that there. And a distress beacon. I like the idea of that. I'll keep an eye on our fuel because... One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that works, I think. We need to get more fuel. So that's not happening. Our drone parts are good now. Despite them being low still. Okay. Yeah, I'll take that. Let's go here. Keeping an eye on the fuel. Okay. So, well... I think it would make sense to fire up the defense drone and hopefully he can shoot some of these asteroids out of the air before they hit us. Oh, our shields are down. Come on, drone. Vulcan will work. Okay, Vulcan won't work. Go fix shields. Um, yeah. Forget the weapon. You two, put out that fire. Any day now, our FTL will charge. Down goes the engines. How to be done in by a heavy ion, of all things. Alright, so, so much for all the repairs we bought. We will ignore the damaged vessels and uh, catch our breath here. So it's pretty clear. Um, our shields are under leveled. Our engines are under leveled. Our weapons take a long time to be viable. And so, yeah, it's just uh, how it goes. We'll try and use the backup battery. We do need to get this Vulcan online, so you go in there. So that means one more power. Here, well, why don't we take the shield offline first. Okay. I think I'll hit up this last beacon sun which is not good we do we can defend against these missiles so I think that's in our best interest to do Vulcan missing is not that big of a deal I've got my eye on this missile put it in shields okay all three of those hit, which is annoying. We just need the Vulcan to fire consecutively. All right, it's fully charged. And there goes the Vulcan. So this is the power of the Vulcan when it's fully charged. It's pretty meaty. I'm gonna take this because I need the fuel, but hopefully this fire goes out first. Thank you. Okay. It blew up. Unfortunately, I can't get anything extra out of that, but there may be a chance that we might still survive this. Sell drone parts. Gosh, that is rough. Um... I gotta really think how will uh, this maximize my chance of surviving. 
I don't think so. Zoltan Homeworlds. I guess it's just straight up better than Zoltan Control, so we'll do that. Okay. Getting out of the nebula would be a pretty good idea. So let's go here first. Another shop to stabilize our wounds of our ship would be a good idea. I see the missile. I see the flat cannon. So defense drone would be a wise investment here. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. Uh, they took down our super shields really easily, but... Shoot, please. Alright, forget about the oxygen. We could really use cloaking. When your defense drone can't even hit... Uh, the missile coming in. Okay, let's see. I need um, the defense drone back. But I don't think I have the power to do it. Okay. Uh, he's gonna hit. I knew it. I kind of failed to get this uh, shield offline, so... We need to get oxygen online. Vulcan is still ready to fire. Our def backup battery is dead. I think this might be it for me. Back in there. Um, well, not really anything else to do here. If they could get that backup battery online, that would be nice. Because we can pop it when this burst comes back online. Okay, shields have held. Vulcan's still got a long way to go. It's at three. We need to get to five. Yeah. This is gonna be the end of us right here. There it is. Alright, well, I guess I'll keep this video just to show you how terrible this ship is. And... It's going to take getting a good weapon early to win, which we have not gotten, and that's really unfortunate. I'm going to end this video and give it another try, so thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I love you. Not really. <laughs>